Here we are with uh, Johannes from Monochrome. Hi, hello. Uh, the bad boy of E-Tech. Oh my God. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> so, <laughs> what do you think of the conference? I mean, it, uh, it's interesting. It was the first time I actually attended uh, like an O'Reilly conference or actually like, uh, let's call it a corporate conference about technology because most of the time I'm going to, you know, like Ars Electronica or stuff like that or stuff like the influencers in Barcelona where it's about like guerrilla communication. And that's why I think you're referring to me as the bad boy because I was talking about guerrilla communication and stuff like that and dressed up as a Soviet officer walking around between like... Uh, uh, like people who are working for Google and stuff like that. Okay, <laughs> it was nice so, uh, because there's uh, one part of my my performance here was like playing the ambassador of this like fictitious Soviet country, really small, called Soviet Untertürkersdorf, and. Uh, of course, I was walking around in uniform and, and many people wanted to take a picture with me. And there was one guy from Yahoo and he said, Ah, oh, can I have a picture with you? You're, you're looking so gorgeous in your, in your uniform. I said, Ah, oh, yeah, no problem. You can, of course, can you come here? Because it is a pleasure. Uh, because you're, you're uh, Yahoo, you're friend of our friends, the Chinese. <laughs> so, <laughs> and he was a little bit pissed about that, I guess. Great, that but sounds I'm, quick. But, but I mean, I, mean it, I think that's... that's I, I think what Monochrome is trying to do, to that's why we call ourselves context hackers. So we try to get into different contexts, for example, letting us invite to a, a, a conference about technology and then spreading a couple of interesting ideas about politics and philosophy and stuff. Yesterday I had a really interesting argument with a libertarian who is working for Google. Uh -huh. So and actually I would consider myself a leftist, yes. not working for Google of course, <laughs> but for a university, so I'm from a completely different You also met uh, Larry Lessig. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, you dedicated to Larry, look at that, the American power! They are yes. censoring our yes, interview. Yes, 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 uh, yes, they are. <laughs> okay, so uh, you actually did a very, very nice song dedicated to Lessig is Lessig, right? Yeah, Les Lessig is Lessig because Lessig, except there's like the the name is with an is, uh, is written with an e, and Lessig in German with an umlaut a uh, means something like cool. Yes. So Lessig is Lessig would be would mean like Lessig is cool, and on a, on, a, on one hand hand it's it's a little bit both it's like a little bit of irony in it and of course it's like a, like an homage because so many people have like standing ovations for Lawrence Lessig Absolutely. and and stuff like that and I thought it would be interesting having like a, a song about Lessig that he's using a wireless mouse and his PowerPoint is perfect and <laughs> <stuff>. <laughs> I don't know okay and of course uh, we have uh, some plans uh, that we are working on right yes 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 I'm already like my my like the Whatever it is that is behind my my faceplate, uh, faceplate, yes, it is already <laughs> like working on the idea of getting uh, some information out there about spines. Yeah, yes, so. and of course we cannot tell what the context hacking will be yeah, yeah. because it must be something very surprising, yeah, 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 yeah. but uh, it will be a lot of fun. But we are Europeans, we are always surprising the world. Absolutely, <laughs> thank you very much. It was a pleasure. <laughs>